Hey my little angels and welcome back to another video you guys. Let's find out who won the back to school item and the winner is... JUK hashtag 4180 congrats. You can DM me on Discord or on forums. The next giveaway is going to be for a 500 cheese coin code, so good luck you guys. Roses are reds, grenades go boom. How can I be stuck when there's so much room? Okay, that's interesting. Seven, thank you so much. And Ava, thank you as well. Oh my goodness, seriously. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Couldn't find the code in the video. Oh, the prior vote word was actually the word calculator. In the prior video, I'd shown it around when I was showing the new honey ground plank stuff. The honey ground, basically. When I was showing the new one, it was at that point of the video, if you wanted to go back and check how it looks like. And, let's see. <laughs> okay. So, the, it was lips, and now it's eyes, and nose, and eyebrows. Okay. <laughs> Doodles for you. Yes, holy. Fish gone nom. <laughs> like, they actually look accurate. Like, how do you do that? And Veronica, oh my goodness, so cute. My other, my squirrel outfit. Oh, look at the acorns are there. So cute. Look at that. It has the hat, the, every, it has everything. So cute. I love the pose. <laughs> really cute. It's like your monthly drawings and artwork. Ah, oh, love that. And we have our new items and we have one permanent tail. They're doing a new whole, a whole new different kind of layering system with a tail as well. So you can actually have different kinds and the kind that wraps around the whole tail. Those options we did see before, which were priorly rejected. Now you can actually suggest those because the layering system has changed a little bit, at least for the tail. So you can actually do these kinds of things. So right now this one's a permanent one and so cute. Look at that. So feel free to go and suggest on Discord or on forums, different kind of tail items and like the wraparound kinds and all that stuff. And then we have more ear items. These, this is from the squirrel fur, so that's the ear of it. Then we have two boxes, kind of back to school like vibes. This is from last year's contest, back to school contest. So this was also like a runner up, I think, or from like one of the winners, something like that. So here we go, we have book boxes, then squirrel ears. It's a versus reward, okay. Huh, they only have four, usually it's a fifth separate item, so okay. <laughs> So would the other side have been, I don't know what the other side reward would have been because I don't think you have anything for ear over there on, on the fur itself. So anyways, that's apparently the reverse's reward. And then you have a cute little tail bow, which is so cute. <laughs> okay, Tig just put out an update like 10, 15 minutes ago and I just saw that right now. So basically there's some more edits to that new honey ground based on what other people have said. You can customize the amount of friction so it can be positive or negative. Positive will make it like stickier negative will make it more towards ice and slippery for this other number is apparently how the level so how quickly you'll regain normal movement so how long that stickiness will last on your rat once you touch honey and if you happen to touch any bit of water the whole the effect of this will immediately go away i believe super liquid honey okay so that's what i mentioned about slippery grounds and yeah so those are the new additions so for people who make maps and stuff or you want to play around with it so you can test yourself on all these different things and try it out. Okay, so you know the standard box pricing. This is the ear item pricing, 700 cheese and 70 fries. Then this one's, okay, it's pretty standard for the tails. It goes right over there, so that's super cute. It's like a gift. <laughs> um, wait, it says it's a collector here. I don't think that's actually right. It's supposed to be a permanent item. Let's see in a couple of days if it still says that, because I don't think that's supposed to be a collector. Pretty sure it's supposed to stay permanently here. But anyways, for this one, it is glitched in Fufri's dress room tool because of the layering. The layering's changed up, so then Fufri has to change some code in the dress room tool, so it's gonna look very wacky. I'm gonna show you there right now after I go and check, show you the sales and the Fashion Squad outfits. So we have some more summer sales still going on up until summertime ends, I guess. So you have your stitch fur, you have that hair. This ear item is so cheap, you should you should seriously consider getting this. This, it's very versatile, it goes with like any outfit. Well, nearly any outfit. So it's really versatile and super cheap because it was a lot older item. Then you have that, then you have a large box. I'm surprised they didn't do a small box with it, but I love the balloons, I've, I've really loved them. 
It's Andy Hell Balloons. If you can't get anything else, get this at least. Very versatile item to use. Mm, now we can go into the other outfit stuff. Okay, so the outfits, they are lazy day themed outfits. So that's kind of like a spa day, having a spa day kind of lazy theme. And this is just like cozy in bed. That's the vibes I'm getting. I really love the creativity on this. Like, look at that. It's like the head turbine kind of thing. Like, you put a towel on top and just like to dry your hair and stuff. So that's what it looks like. And then over here, I love the color combination. I don't think I've seen this fur being used in outfits much. So that's really cool that was used here. I love the colors on this one. Let's see how these match up for collectors versus in shop. So that's a collector and that is permanently in shop. Permanent, collector, collector, permanent, I believe. Permanent, collector, pricing a bit steep. <laughs> Okay, same with this one. So you have a collector, collector, collect. I feel like this thing came out so recently. <laughs> but anyways, that's a collector, that's a collector. Collector, permanent, collector. So everything's a collector except for the contact lens. Okay. <laughs> well, I mean, if you want a lot of collector stuff and you recently missed the ear item, definitely get that. Oh, especially for the fur. I don't think I've seen that around in a while. Well, anything that's a collector, you'd go for that. Same case here. So those are the outfits. Now the customization. Okay, do you want to see the wacky placement of the tail in this case? Like here. <laughs> Look at that. It's not, that's not the right placement of the tail, but I can probably show you the customizations on this one still. Okay, it's pretty basic. I'm surprised they didn't like gradient it. Okay, I, I kind of like gradients on everything now, so. <laughs> but there you go, you have a nice, simple, cute little tail, which is supposed to be down here. I can show it to you in the dressing code like the dressing thing on TFM itself. I'll do that in a bit. We have ears. So we have these ears. Let's see. That's a lot of customization. That's a lot of gradients. Okay. The top, the bottom, the middle-ish, and then like the very bottom. Then you have the inside top, inside middle, inside fluff, and then the bottom. Then you have, okay, you have it separately on those. Okay, the order is actually decent. So you have that. <laughs> So those are your fluffy ears, very fluffy. This is like a different style. Yeah, I like the other ones better because of the gradients. This is not gradiented because it has like the outer color than fluff. This has the inner color. Same with this one, except this has gradients. So I love this one more. Let's see. I'm just trying to compare between these two. This one's more fluffy compared to that. Hmm. Okay. So that's that. Now the um, sham item stuff. Okay, so the sham item update script had to be run to be able to see these, and I believe both of these are nearly the same. Let's see the color combinations. Okay, so you have the belt first, like the buckle, the belt, upper, mid, okay. This, and then middle row, that line, and then the lower one. I think it's going to be similar in this case. Let's look at this. Yep, same order. That's pretty decent, actually. So that's a good order. And yeah, that's how you customize those. Okay, so here you try massage dressing. I don't use this as much, but I'll show you the tail item. I believe it's pretty much like the more, um, I don't know, fancier or more cleaner version of this tail. <laughs> like that's what I feel about it. Like if you want to like dress up and be more classy, you would wear this tail versus the other one, which is like the super old one. Cause I've made this outfit, okay, minus this in the contacts. I made it like eight, not, like nine years ago by now, I guess. Probably nine years ago. Hmm. Oh wait, probably almost 10 years in a month or two months. But yeah, so that's when those items were out, except for the fur, I had to add that in when it came out, I believe. Anyways, so let's see, that's where it's supposed to be. So customization, you can't randomize it here, so you have to do it yourself. Ah, oh. and so I love you for using dress room tools, so fun. But you can't really see it much on the fur <laughs> either. But anyways, that's the location of it. And at least when you move, it's not going to like swing around too much because it's going to be settled down here. And I think that's pretty much it for this video, you guys. Hope you guys have an amazing day. Bye. Kitty result, as always. Peace.